<clears throat> okay, I'm running uh, <clears throat> 6S on my uh, Outcast. tell you, 6S is so much more funner than the 4. <clears throat> so is what I did here, <clears throat> guys, um, I find it saves the body big time. Is uh, I work at a mining company and they have this like it's a soft rubber and uh, if you're ripping on pavement or anything like that and you don't want to scuff your body up really bad and uh, slide down the road but uh, I guess these are that's what this is for but I don't like to because I've worn out so many so many bodies so and I find the front is where it wears the most and the roof so this has grip, so every time I slide, these catch instantly and it stops my truck from sliding. Like, uh, like this takes the wear and the tear. And I've probably saved a lot of scratches from this body. And it's, it's in immaculate shape, this body still. Like, I've undercoated the inside. I've put like a felt on each side here and I've used uh, <clears throat> a duct tape around the things here to uh, just not wear it down and the sides so uh, yeah the truck bed liner works excellent it's I did two coats and it's amazing so this is my truck uh, I got a guy custom making me uh, the 
dividers right here for the posts. He's making me two aluminum ones. He's already took the specs and the measurements and everything. I'm just waiting for them. So I'll have those aluminum too. And then I'm going to get the aluminum wing, which will reinforce it for sure. And uh, yeah, so uh, I'm running those. And uh, <clears throat> the castle fan, the one that comes in the castle fan, it absolutely blows. Blows, blows, blows. So I went and got an Intigy and a Hot Racing Turbo High Torque Fan, 30 mil by 10 mil, and replaced it. And this thing works amazing. It works good now. But I got a Hobby Wing <coughs> RC Basher. Uh, I see him using those Hobby Wing ones, and uh, I ordered one, so I'm gonna give her a shot and try it out. But uh, I recommend if you have any <coughs> any Arma, you get the servo mount. It is absolutely needed. Thanks. See you soon. Well, not see you, but I'll make a video soon. <coughs> Oh, sorry, one more thing. <clears throat> and uh, I see people, like, some. I'm figuring the, the pinions. Sometimes, like, I just broke one tooth off my pinion the other day. And I'm thinking, like, there's a lot of torque there. But I got an order on. I have ordered the hot racing mount and the aluminum mount inside here. And I'm hoping that'll stop any shift in there, which I have the the gearbox too, the diff box, aluminum, and uh, yeah. And uh, the T-bone bumper is amazing. I had it off. My normal bumper, I took it off because I didn't think the T-bone would fit. But I find leaving it on is just only going to protect my shocks more from stuff or debris, whatever. So I went and just left it on. And it looks fine. And when you put your body on, you have that extra length from rocks spitting and all that stuff. But uh, yeah, this is my Arma Outcast and take care.